morning students hi good morning students today i am here to explain you one of the uh, interesting chapters is natural environment and pollution natural natural environment environment and and pollution pollution okay dear students in this module you will learn to what is meant by natural environment and also you will learn to yes environmental pollution and also which are the most important types of yes pollution there are some types okay which are the most important types of pollution and also dear students you will learn about yes the what are the causes for the pollutions and yes precautionary measures what are the precautionary measures taken up by the government to solve the problem of environmental pollution see uh, what is meant by is a uh, natural environment see as you know that here the word natural environment which means surrounding in which organisms live okay this is called as yes uh, natural environment the surrounding in which yes organisms live okay yes uh, humans will be living in the nature okay yes all the creatures and animals is yes, have been living in this nature or environment okay dear students nature has blessed with an environment okay this nature for example if you are seeing a tree uh, uh, outside okay yes uh, if you see a uh, river outside okay if you see yes a stone outside okay this is all uh, nature gift okay this is all what nature gift okay nature has blessed us yes so many things okay that's why we have been living very happily right and healthily that, that is very very important and very importantly yes the natural environment which includes all living and non living organisms can you tell me dear students which are the best example for the living organisms okay yes we human okay animals okay domestic animals right these are all called as best example for the yes sir, living things non living things table chair mobile phone pen pencil rubber these are all the best example for the yes non living thing can you agree with me yes sir, as you know that here yes sir, in the nature yes many objects are available okay which are the uh, objects that are available in the nature okay especially on the earth okay yes we see climate and weather we see climate and weather there is a lot of difference between a climate and yes a weather right yes uh, climate is a long term weather is a short term right the weather will change yes instantly okay see uh, hey, most of the time we talk to each other see uh, morning there was a hot sun already afternoon session there is a uh, raining right just we are going to speak like that am i right or not children so this is also one of the most important yes uh, uh, term right yes that is why this is also available in nature a natural resources that affect human survival okay yes a nature can live without human but human cannot live without nature because usually human has been dependent more on nature okay see uh, look at a man okay he has been cutting down all the trees and he is converting that area into urban uh, urban right usually human has been dependent upon yes the nature nature has not been dependent upon human can you agree with me that is why yes uh, the na natural environment provides us yes fresh air what are the benefits of natural environment children okay yes the natural environment will be given us fresh air okay fresh air okay this is very very important okay see so here yes so uh, uh, oxygen very is, uh, is very important children okay to take breath right yes the nature is providing us yes a pure and fresh air but man is polluting yes air okay then i will explain you yes how air pollution is being yes occurred and yes not only yes fresh air but clean water second one okay what natural environment will, will be given us yes clean water okay clean water the clean water okay will be provided by yes natural environment pure water okay do you know children yes uh, the the kind of water you take which decides your health 
okay if you take pure and yes uh, fresh water definitely your health will be good okay if you do not take yes your health will be upset right not only yes of your water plants okay the environmental yes the natural environment will be provided us yes plant okay see as you all know that here the human has been dependent upon some plants okay we grow vegetables am i right or not and coconut and just a uh, uh, mango okay pomegranate okay look at all the fruits and vegetables okay yes this is gifted by yes nature this is gifted by nature and not only yes plants sunlight sunlight is also very important okay yes uh, if we get a proper sunlight definitely our health will be increased we don't get any kind of skin diseases okay if we do not get a proper if we do not get a proper sunlight okay yes we get what yes skin diseases best example yes australian people okay australian people will be mostly suffering from yes shortage of sun rays uh, sun rays okay they don't get proper sun rays sunlight that is the reason yes they will usually having a what will be having a what yes skin diseases am i right or not that is why in the sea shores okay they will be yes uh, sleeping in the nude right yes this is okay many more things now we shall study about environmental pollution okay what is meant by environmental uh, uh, pollution environmental pollution which always introduces okay yes uh, uh, contaminants okay which are the most important contaminants in the environment okay that causes of the yes uh, discomfort to humans or uh, living organisms okay yes uh, this natural or environmental pollution which has been caused for the what yes uh, huge damage for human life for example the waste from a factory okay the factories have been discharging some waste okay especially dear students uh, i i want to trace out this okay listen to your story the river ganga okay we have seven okay we have seven sacred rivers in india in which the banks of the river ganga we will find more and more industries those industries have been discharging some waste those industries they, they, they have been discharging some chemical water to the river because of that yes the water pollution has been occurring am i right yes uh, uh, and very importantly yes the environmental problem is becoming more serious day by day this is one of the greatest problems one of the what greatest problems okay yes and this and all we need to understand now we should study about which, which are the different types of pollution okay let us see one by one which are the most important okay okay types of types of pollution okay types of pollution which are the most important types of pollution okay let us see one by one the first one which is the first one now the first one is here air pollution okay air pollution okay air pollution second one which is very very important yes water pollution water pollution which is the third one the third one is very very important land pollution land pollution which is the fourth one yes the fourth one is here noise pollution this is very very important noise pollution the next one after noise pollution what do you find out yes light pollution okay l i g h t light pollution okay 1 2 3 4 5 one more the last one is here which is very very important yes nuclear pollution which is that nuclear nuclear pollution okay these are the most important yes pollutions okay now we shall study about each and every pollution deeply right the first one is here air pollution how does air pollution occur okay this is okay this is one of the most important pollutions that we learn okay see as you know that here okay when you start living in delhi and bangalore usually there will be a lot of yes air pollution what is the reason for that the reason is here do you not children delhi and bangalore have been 
having the highest traffic heavy vehicles those vehicles will be discharging some smoke in the air they will be discharging some smoke in the air do you understand children okay yes uh, uh, diesel petrol okay yes uh, fossil fuel okay they will be discharging the smoke in the air the air will become what yes polluted and factories okay pinya dasarli bangalore dear students pinya dasarli those two places which have been yes uh, concentrated more more industries which have been concentrated more more industries and those have been are discharging a huge smoke in the air at that time yes the air will become what yes polluted there uh, uh, there will become polluted can you agree with me this is what is that air pollution air pollution occurs when gases dust particles fumes smokes and chemicals are introduced into the atmosphere they have been introduced into the atmosphere okay into the atmosphere in a way that yes makes it harmful to humans and animals and plants because of this okay yes our respiratory problem will be having our what is that here respiratory problem we cannot as a breathe and heart problem okay we will be having what heart problem okay yes this all diseases these kind of diseases will be occurring to all the human you must understand and very very importantly what are the main causes for the air pollution okay we need to understand okay yes causes which are the major causes for the yes air pollution the first and foremost is here the air pollu air pollution can result from both human and the natural yes uh, actions most of the time yes air pollution will be occurred due to the human activities most of the time yes uh, the air pollution will be occurred due to the natural activities okay let us see which are they natural events that pollute the air includes forest fire automatically nobody will be setting up the fire fire in the uh, forest automatically most of the time yes the uh, fire will be set up okay itself in the forest okay due to what yes crashes between the crashes between the yes a uh, trees especially bamboo tree okay the bamboo trees will be getting what crash okay at that time here yes there will be causing for yes uh, a fire am i right or not there will be causing for what fire okay that is natural activity the nature has been made that nobody has been made that am i right or not and uh, human activities most of the time what does human do okay he will cut down all the trees and yes uh, he will be uh, setting up a, a fire for those cut, uh, cut, uh, cut trees automatically uh, that will discharge some smoke in the air am i right or wrong that this will be causing for the yes uh, air pollution that we need to understand forest fire volcanic eruption especially north america i would like to give an example for yes so volcanic eruption north america is the best example in the north america most of the time in the year okay yes there is a huge uh, content of what yes uh, volcanic eruptions the volcanics okay spitting out yes uh, the balls of what yes uh, fire okay that is called as volcanic am i right or not yes and pollen disposal etc human activities that result in the air pollution okay these are all the yes the causes now let us see now here yes the human activities how human activities yes causes for the yes pollution the first one is which is very very important emission from industries and factories okay already i explained it yesterday look at the factories nearby usually they will be discharging yes heavy smoke especially if you just go forward just 18 kilometers away from tumkur you will find is wasanta narsapura an industrial area there a cottage and small scale industry we find more than 180 industries dear students you might be knowing or not knowing right yes there will be yes 180 yes industries concentrated do not children my village is just 3 kilometers away from that yes industrial area the smell of that is bad smell the chemical smell of that factory will be is yes, up to 3 kilometers will be up to 3 kilometers 
the smoke will be spread in the air the chemical smoke spread in the air especially the people who have been uh, living nearby okay they have lot of respiratory problems they have lot of diseases respiratory problems heart problems okay even most of the time the the case has been find up okay to removal of those industries but no the emissions of this industries and factories have been one of the reasons for the uh, yes air pollution okay the factories will be discharging the more 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 high level of yes carbon dioxide carbon monoxide smoke fumes and chemicals into the air this will be occurring and petroleum refineries also release lots of hydro uh, hydro corporate hydro hydro carbons in the air into the air this is human activity nature has not done this the human has done this dear, dear students okay the next one burning fossil fuel okay okay just burning out what it is uh, fossil fuel the transport has become a necessary evil for us today we use more transport okay even we don't use yes private transport uh, public transport we use private transport in each house okay has two to three cars two to three bikes okay when those vehicles uh, uh, release or uh, discharge a smoke in the air you just imagine okay then where do we find a solution for that okay fossil fuel cars trucks motorcycle burn lots of fossil fuels to work and release pollu pollutants they bring diesel and petrol we put in the vehicles and it converts as a smoke and mixed in the air and most of the factories will uh, take up take out yes petroleum and petroleum products to run the factory they will discharge heavy smoke in the air okay these are all the best example for the yes air pollution fumes from the auto vehicles contain yes a dangerous gases such as carbon monoxide okay the dangerous yes uh, chemicals hydrocarbons and yes particular uh, particulates these have been mixed in the air and third one the human activity how it has been yes caused for the, the air pollution okay household activities the domestic activities farming is a uh, chemicals how they have been caused for the yes, air pollution let us see household cleaning products most of the time the clean water will be used for washing dresses washing mattress am i right and painting supplies at the time of for example here in your house your parents will set up a plan to paint the house right yes you just imagine the the paint will be consuming lot of yes water that chemical will be mixed in the air the smell we, we cannot even yes uh, take that smell smell can be experienced we cannot touch it do you know that children okay gobi how do you experience the the gobi is so good very good smell smell can be experienced we cannot touch okay here also the painting that smell will be mixed in the air and causes for air pollution and very importantly spraying insecticides as we are all living in the agricultural country even our parents have been doing agricultural activities am i right our children okay yes what do they do for example i give one of, one of the examples yes uh, uh, growing cotton okay actually the cotton plants are required more more pesticides okay we need to use more pesticides we need to use more pesticides instead of uh, using pesticides on the leaves of the cotton we leave on the land and that will be mixed in the air and causes once upon a time i think few years back when i was applying some chemical pesticides uh, to the plants okay i didn't uh, i didn't take any precautionary this one okay measures wearing a gloves and mask okay i was not doing that okay just directly went into the plant okay just i started doing that too they believe or not after one hour okay the, my body started swelling why there are some yes, chemical, uh, chemicals okay mixed in the uh, pesticides okay this is also one of the reasons and very importantly yes uh, fertilizers 
there are some chemical fertilizers 2020 potassium okay these are also very very harmful okay yes to the air right yes now which are the effects of the air pollution okay we need to learn about which are the most important effects of the air pollution we need to learn okay effect which means here we, when we start doing this okay yes what will happen okay to our health okay that is what is effect the first and foremost is here yes if we allow air pollution to grow in the environment it causes yes acid uh, rain okay the acid rain will occur we are getting a rain am i right or not most of the time yes we'll get the acid rain chemical mixed rain and heart diseases will be getting what some heart diseases will have some problem in the heart right and very importantly yes uh, uh, leaves of plants kills animals fish and other wild animals uh, wild life the wild life will be washed away the creatures in the water will be washed away the everything will be washed away okay this is the first effect and the second effect is here as you know that here we will be having some respiratory problems children we cannot even breathe we take this is okay there will be a problem of what respiratory we cannot even take a proper uh, uh, breathing okay see the covid 19 okay the covid 19 almost four days it will be here okay before yes going into your lungs okay yes we have to take some precautions or medicines right yes like that as you know that here if we use more more chemicals right yes we will be having a heart problem and respiratory problem okay and heart diseases especially for example yes majority of children in delhi in the delhi most of the children have been suffering from respiratory problems because the vehicles and factories have been discharging a huge smoke in the air once it is mixed in the air finish we cannot leave healthily am i right or not delhi are presently suffering from yes a pneumonia and those children have become asthmatic they have become what asthmatic and asthma due to heavy air pollution okay yes how asthma, uh, asthma will uh, occur in the human body due to the heavy what yes air pollution due to heavy air pollution it will be occurred we need to learn then the governments have been sitting simply no the government, have, the government of India, both central government and state government, have taken a lot of measures to remove this yes, air pollution. Then, which are the measures that have been taken up by the government to removal of yes, air pollution? Okay, the first and foremost is here. Yes, first measure. Okay, use public mode of transport. Okay, instead of using our personal or private transport, going by bike going by yes car use public transport bus government bus we have to use that then the 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 level of yes air pollution will be reduced i'm not telling that we cannot remove okay it will be reduced this is the first measure the second measure is here conserve energy okay conserve energy switch off fans and lights when not in use most of the time Yes, you will be watching, right? What do you do? Yes, uh, you can advise your uh, siblings, right? Yes, uh, dear, dear brother, come on, switch off the lights and come outside. Okay, in daytime also, most of the houses, the lights will be on in the room. And before coming out from the room, we never bother about switching off the yes, lights. Okay, when the lights not in use, we must do that. That is also one of the precautions. Okay, third one, use a clean energy what is meant by clean energy energy like solar instead of using electrical power supply we must take the energy from the solar solar panels should be fixed i know it is uh, too much costly even middle class people cannot be fixed into it am i right yes but the government has to take that measure even it has been taken pavada you know children yes pavada okay yes uh, me, uh, in the, in the almost uh, 100 acres, 150 acres, okay, the solar panels have been established. Okay, what is the purpose of fixing the solar panels? Okay, to get the yes, solar energy, right? The solar energy, right? And wind energy, 
Okay, yes, if you go to North Karnataka, Raichur Gulbarga Bida, this is very flat land. Okay, no more trees, right? There, we'll be finding the windmill. Okay, like fan, it will be rotating. Okay, it produces what energy? If you go to North India also, Punjab, Haryana, Rajasthan, you will find more and more, yes, windmills. Right? These are all the measures to be taken. And one more measure, plant as many trees. Every year in the month of June, we celebrate uh, June 5th as a World Environmental Day. See, what day has come to us? Right? It is our prime duty to sample a plant. It is our prime duty to sample tree. Are we doing that? No. In order to create awareness among the, yes, people. Do, do you know, children? Yes, the 5th uh, June is celebrating as World Environmental Day. The World Envi en Environmental Day will be celebrating. Okay. Yes, in order to create awareness among the people about environment. Don't cut down the trees. Afforestation and deforestation. Instead of going to uh, deforestation, yes, we have to do afforestation. Am I right? And very importantly, yes, we have to learn the recycling use of materials. Okay. This is also one of the major, yes, uh, uh, measures. Last one. Yes, use advanced technologies to minimize the release of harmful gases from the industries. Especially, there are two kinds of industries. First one is manufacturing industries, dear students. Okay. The first one is what? Manufacturing industries. The second one is cottage and small scale industries. But heavy smoke will be discharged in the manufacturing industries. In the manufacturing industries, they have to think that they have to adopt, yes, high form of technology. Like Italy, France, Italy, France, Germany, UK, America. Okay. These countries have been adopted high form of technology. When they use high form of technology in the industries, they will discharge, okay, yes, less level of, yes, smoke in the air. Okay, yes, that is also one of the most important, yes, measures. Now, we shall moving towards, we shall be moving towards, yes, the next one is here, water pollution, water pollution, okay, yes, how water pollution will be occurred. And you should learn, water is like Amruta. Okay, without water, I think this is too tough to survive. This is too tough to survive. Am I right or not? Okay, so that is why here, how does water pollution occur? Okay, and the, all the diseases will be occurring from the water. Okay, the, the, the water we drink, okay, that should be pure and fresh. That should be pure and fresh. Right, now let us see about, yes, water pollution. Water pollution is the uh, contamination of water bodies by the human activities. Even the water bodies have been, yes, uh, getting polluted. The water bodies have been getting polluted. Do you understand, children? And it occurs when pollutants, particles, chemicals or substances that have been mixed in the water. I was giving you an example, dear students. Okay, look at the, yes, the river Ganga. On the banks of the river Ganga, multiple industries have been established. What they have been doing? They have been discharging the bad chemical water into the river. The bad chemical water into the river. The water has become polluted. Then, especially, uh, this is not in the textbook. Yes, the central government of India has been appointed Ganga River Cleaning Authority. You have to understand children. What kind of pollution has been going on? You just yes, keep this in your mind. Ganga Cleaning Authority. Ganga River Cleaning Authority. The department has been created by the central government. You just imagine how much the Ganga River has been yes, polluted. Am I right? Due to COVID-19, I really once in the one side, I, I happily accepted that Corona. Okay, because last year, six to eight months, right? Yes, uh, uh, all the uh, environment and rivers have been fresh because there is no human entry. That is the reason. And rivers have been pure, especially Ganga River, which has been pure and clean because there is there are no people due to Corona. Am I right? Okay, but uh, this is not fair. That let it be closed very soon. I want to see you all in the school. Uh, you have to resume back to school. Okay, yes, uh, this is uh, one of the major reasons for the, yes, water pollution. 
okay what are the major causes for the yes water pollution right yes uh, this is all my chapter okay in the next period i'm going to start okay yes the rest part of the chapter up to now we studied about what is meant by environmental pollution and i explained two important yes pollutions yes air pollution what is meant by air pollution causes for the air pollution and also measures taken up by the government to control air pollution i'll continue in the next class thank you all bye bye take care